and welcome to an introduction to the Cisco Virtual Beacon Solution. The Cisco Virtual Beacon Solution is an easy to configure, cost effective alternative to battery operated physical beacons that interact with smart devices based on their location. The solution includes three components. A Cisco Beacon Point, which is a steerable 16 antenna element array that is powered over the Ethernet, thus eliminating the need for batteries. The Cisco Beacon Center, that is a subscription-based software offered over the CMX Cloud. And finally, a mobile SDK that can be used to create applications for both iOS and Android operating systems. I'm now going to demo how easy it is to configure proximity marketing and indoor navigation using this exciting solution. So, you've purchased your first Cisco Beacon Point and decide to mount it at an ideal location in your business space. Remember that the device has a coverage area of 2,500 square feet and a recommended height of 13 feet. Note the position and orientation of the device so that we can enter it later in the Beacon Center tool. Now connect the Beacon Point with the cloud-based Beacon Center. To do this, flip over the device and use the claim code number listed here to claim the device on the cloud. Now power on the device over the Ethernet using either a power injector or a switch. Observe the LED on the device turning from red to green, indicating a successful connection to the cloud. If this doesn't happen, refer to the documentation and troubleshoot the LED status. Next, load the maps of your business space to the cloud. In the Cisco Beacon Center GUI, click the Sites tab. After adding a campus and a building, you can load the maps of your floors. You can upload floor maps as images or in vector map format. The floor map size is automatically calculated and displayed. You can also define known distances on the map. Now that the floor maps are in place, you can enter the beacon point position you noted earlier and even drag the beacon point to the right orientation indicating LED direction. Now it's time to configure points of interest. Identify them on your floor space and configure your virtual beacon with a simple click of your mouse. None of those expensive complicated site surveys and relocating a virtual beacon is just as easy. Now, let's see how the solution works. Users first install applications on their smart devices, applications that use the solution's SDK. Now, when a smart device enters the coverage area of a beacon point, it receives beams from it. The smart device then sends beams as BLE RSSI observations to the Beacon Center over Wi-Fi or LTE. The Cisco Beacon Center can now estimate the location of the smart device and send map information back to the mobile application. When a user enters the proximity of a point of interest represented by a virtual beacon, you as the business owner can push URLs, messages or custom actions to the smart device. Window navigation is another powerful feature that is just as easy to configure. You need a minimum of three beacon points per map to implement turn-by-turn -turn navigation. You can configure and push a more relevant path that makes business sense to your users and not just the shortest path to the destination. While easy to configure proximity marketing and indoor navigation are key features, the Cisco Virtual Beacon solution also provides you with analytics that can further improve your marketing efforts. Let me show you how this works. I can do this by configuring zones or polygonal areas that can be used to display these metrics. 
Just ensure that your zones are large enough and sufficiently spaced to improve accuracy. Thus, you can see that the Cisco Virtual Beacon is a first-of-its kind solution that eases the configuration of proximity marketing and indoor navigation. It improves customer experience of your business, be it retail, healthcare, hospitality, or public-facing venues. Find out more about this solution from the link below. We hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Thank you.